May-day celebrations were also held in the southeast and south-south states. TVC News senior reporter Ikena Michi captured the events in this report. In Asaba, the different unions participated in the parade at the cenotaph as Governor Oborowori also joined to celebrate with them. Beyond the fun fair of the celebration of the May first day here in Asaba is the need for an improved welfare and wages for workers. You are aware that there is a negotiation or minimum wage going on. As a responsible government, I will deliberate with my team on our best to address them with the limits of resources available to us. In River State, Governor Simina Lai Fubara attended his first Workers' Day celebration at the Yakubugu One Stadium in Port Harcourt. We are going to work with the federal government to implement necessary measures, including the continuation of the free health services and the provision of necessary palliative to ameliorate the current hardship faced by ordinary citizens. This is Michael Okpara Square, Enugu, the venue for this year's Workers' Day commemoration in the state. In that our government is committed to doing everything needed to be done to make the welfare of workers better than we met it. The Workers' Day celebration at the Ndubisi Kano Square in Oweri afforded Governor Hopo Zodima the opportunity to deliver cherry news to the workers. For the past 18 years, workers have not received gratuity from 2006. By yesterday, 3,000 people were paid, and we paid 100 percent. For Governor Alex Oti of Abia State, he recognizes the impact of workers as agents of development and promised to prioritize their welfare. I'm pleased to inform you that we shall take the lead in implementation as soon as a new national wage is agreed. These workers hope that government at all levels we keep to their promises to avoid any counter-reaction from them. Ikenna Amechi, TVC News, Asaba.